When you feel like giving up, don't. When you're thinking about giving up, don't. When it look like you ain't going to make it, keep going. When they tell you you can't, come on, man, who are they? When they tell you you're not going to make it, don't believe them, man. Don't believe them. You got to be relentless. Where have you been? Why are you here? And where are you going? You look at your life. You look at what you produce. Is it giving you what you want? Are you living on purpose? Are you living your dream? Are you acting on your ideas? Are you doing all you can do? Have you gotten comfortable? Are you procrastinating? Are you invading your own greatness? Are you surrounding yourself with people that can nourish you? Are you challenging yourself? Are you experimenting? Are you learning something different? Is your life an adventure or is it boring? When you're set in your mind and you refuse to grow and you're not open to new ideas, new methods, new ways of doing things, if your mind is already fixed, you become stagnant. You can't grow. You can't have a sense of fulfillment. You become extremely cynical and negative about everything. Don't give up. Don't give up. Stay in it. Stay focused. Quitting guarantees the failure. Once you quit, it rules out any chance of succeeding. The mere waking up every day, putting the next foot in front of the next foot, at least keeps you in the game. It's not going to be easy when you want to change. It's not easy. If it were in fact easy, everybody would do it. But if you're serious, you'll go all out. Yes, I'm going to do something about this situation. You do what it is you're supposed to. You're supposed to build something. You're supposed to create something. I don't know how to do it. Learn. Do whatever is required. Just go out there. It's possible you can get what you want. It's necessary. If you want it, you got to go into action. You got to be willing to experiment. You got to be willing to fail and to succeed. It's you. It's on you. You got to make that happen. Nobody's going to bring it to you on a civil platter and say, here's your dream manifested. No, it's hard. Yes, it's hard. It's difficult. Yes, right. And it's worth it. I'm unstoppable. This will not get me down. You've got to make those kind of declarations to yourself. I have never met anybody who became incredibly successful in any area of their life until they had suffered and sweated and sacrificed and kept their focus and fought through tears and trials and tests. And if you have a dream and you commit to it, it will come to pass. You must have patience and engage in consistent action. We live in a world, ladies and gentlemen, where people want instant gratification. They want it right now. No, it's simple, but it's not easy. It's a system that if you work the system, it works if you work it. But make no mistake about it. It's hard. And you are the determining factor. The people that make it in this world look around for the circumstances that they want, and if they can't find them, they create them. It's you that you must take personal responsibility to make it happen. It's hard. No easy is not an option. However, ladies and gentlemen, what you will discover is that it's worth it. Write down five reasons of why it is worth it for you to become a diamond to experience that level of achievement? What is it that will give you the drive? What is it that will ignite the courage in you to get up and come back again and again and again? How is it that you would be able, what reasons that can tap in to that deep down feeling that goes to your gut, that no matter how many times you get knocked down, that you're coming back? Listen to me, this is how you do it first over six, seven years ago with no money, no human resources, no building, no funding, no support. The first thing we did was we dreamed, we wrote the dream down, we rehearsed the dream, we looked at the dream, we talked about the dream, we slept with the dream, we woke up to the dream, we wore the dream, and now boom, 
It's our reality. And for some of you, you stop dreaming. You dream for a week and you stop because things around you don't look good. You dream for a month and when you get hit in the mouth, you quit and you give up. You dream for a while and when people tell you crazy, when people tell you stupid, and when people tell you you can never get done, you stop dreaming and you go back to knowledge. And I dare you to use your imagination. I dare you when you broke to use your imagination. I dare you when you rich to use your imagination. I dare you under every single circumstance Keep dreaming, keep looking at your dream, keep focusing on your dream, keep going after the dream because that's where true success is. Let me tell you something you already know. The world ain't all sunshine and rainbows. It's a very mean and nasty place and I don't care how tough you are, it will beat you to your knees and keep you there permanently if you let it. You need a nobody. He's going to hit as hard as life. But it ain't about how hard you hit. It's about how hard you can get hit and keep moving forward. How much you can take and keep moving forward. That's how winning is done. Now, if you know what you're worth, then go out and get what you're worth. But you got to be willing to take the hits and not pointing fingers saying you ain't where you want to be because of him or her or anybody. You're better than that. Whenever you feel negative or unhappy about anything, you say, wait a minute, I'm responsible. I'm responsible for my life. I'm responsible for what happens. I can't change the past, so I'm not going to spend a second worrying about the past. I'm going to become so busy working on my future and my goals that I don't have time to think about the past.